In this video, we learn how to pair two HM10 Bluetooth modules. One as the master. And the other as a slave. Let's connect one HM10 Bluetooth module to an Arduino Uno board. Let's configure this board as a slave. Connect as per the schematic, one of the HM10 boards, which we want to configure as a slave. We have wired the Arduino serial transmit and receive pins to the transmit and receive pins of HM10. Since HM10 is a 3.3 volt logic device, we have to convert the voltage levels coming from Arduino to a 3.3 volt compatible level. For this, we are using a voltage divider circuit with two resistors. Here, we are using the Arduino to just interface the HM10 Bluetooth module to the PC. The Arduino board is flashed with a blank code, this is to ensure that there is no serial transmit or receive function from the Arduino microcontroller. Now, open the serial monitor tool in the Arduino IDE. This tool is present under the tools menu. We are going to use the serial monitor tool as a serial terminal. Type the command AT and click send button. Check if the HM10 module responds with an OK. Let's check if HM10 module is configured as master or as slave. For this, you need to issue the command AT plus roll and click send. Here the roll is shown as zero, which means that the HM10 module is configured currently as slave. Now remove the slave HM10 module and let's connect another HM10 module to configure it as master. Type the AT command and check if the HM10 module responds with an OK. Let's check if HM10 module is configured as master or as slave. Issue the command AT plus roll and press send. Here, the roll is shown as zero, which means the HM10 module by default is configured currently as slave. Now let's make it master with the command AT plus roll one. Check the roll once again by the command AT plus roll and press send. It will return as one, indicating that it is configured as master. Now we need to power up the slave HM10 and pair with the master. To do this, connect the VCC and G and D pins of the slave unit to five volts and ground respectively. Now in the master HM10 unit, which is already connected to the Arduino board, type the command to pair the master HM10 unit to slave. To know the command, type AT plus help command in the Arduino serial monitor. This will make the master list the commands supported. Issue the command AT plus INQ to search for the nearby Bluetooth modules. The command returns the address of the slave devices that it detects nearby. Now copy the address of the slave identified and issue the command AT plus band followed by the address of the slave. This command pairs the master to the slave and if successful, it returns OK plus connected. Now to confirm this, we can remove the power supply of the slave and then we notice that the LED on the master HM10 module starts to blink. Once we connect back the power supply of slave, then we see that the master is able to automatically pair and the LED on the master stops blinking and stays on indicating successful pairing with the slave unit. Now let's connect the master to the joystick module. And the slave to an Arduino board driving the car wheels.
Now we are able to receive the commands sent by the master HM10 unit at the slave.